So here we are looking at Hamiltonian and semi-Hamiltonian graphs. Now these are closely related to Eulerian and semi-Eulerian graphs. Now, semi-Eulerian and Eulerian graphs, they were interested in edges. You couldn't repeat edges. You couldn't go down the same road twice. And if you could get the whole way around the graph and not repeat the same edge, uh, then that was an Eulerian graph. Hamiltonian graphs are interested in vertices. The goal here is to get the entire way around the graph, touching every vertex, but only touching every vertex once, except the one that you start and you finish on. So a Hamiltonian graph has a closed path using every vertex. Now, in terms of sort of thinking about towns and roads, you want to start at a town and you want to visit every town and you want to get back to where you started. But you don't want to visit a town more than once. All right, so I'm going to try a few ideas here. Let's see how I go. I'm going to go from A to B to H to G uh, to D, and then from to E to F to A. Great, except I forgot C. So I got back to where I started, but I didn't visit one of the towns. That's a big problem. All right, let's try something else. Um, we'll go... C, B, H, G, D, E, F, A. I visited all the towns, but I didn't get back to where I started from. That's a different problem. Um, now, that might be the best I can do here. So, let's try drawing that in for a second. All right, so that's my path. C, B, H, G, D, E, F, A. I didn't get back home. So, this, at the moment... This might not be a Hamiltonian graph, but what I can say with certainty is that it is definitely a semi-Hamiltonian graph. Now, obviously, a semi-Hamiltonian graph is going to be an open path using every vertex. So, I know it's a semi-Hamiltonian graph. I know it's a semi-Hamiltonian graph because I've just achieved it. I've just gotten through all of the towns using an open path. Uh, is it a Hamiltonian graph? I don't know. Um, there is no good way, no sort of easy, simple way that I can test for whether that's a Hamiltonian graph. I could create a computer program that tests every single combination of letters and tests whether each of them is a closed path using every vertex, but that's about the best we can do. This is a really, really difficult problem in the sense that we don't have a nice mathematical count the degrees of each vertex and that'll tell you whether it's a Hamiltonian graph or not. Now, I'm going to make it a Hamiltonian graph. I'm going to cheat. Um, just like, let's add an edge. Now, this is a Hamiltonian graph. He went from C to B to H to G to D to E to F to A, and then all the way back to C. That is a Hamiltonian graph. Now again, I don't know if it's a Hamiltonian graph without that. I haven't tested every single vertex, but that's what you would have to do to determine whether something is Hamiltonian or not. Uh, that's it, Hamiltonian and semi-Hamiltonian graphs.